ओके व्हाट शुड यू बाय इन 2021 इधर एन आर्डिनो और एसपी 8266 और एसपी 32 वी विल कंपेयर एंड फाइंड इट आउट हु विंस द रेस ऑफ कोर्स आई विल गिव यू माय पर्सनल ओपिनियन लेट्स टॉक अबाउट द साइज द लेंथ ऑफ आर्डिनो ओनो इज 69 मिलीमीटर व्हाइल द विड्थ इज 53 मिलीमीटर इन एसपी 8266 द लेंथ इज 48 मिलीमीटर एंड विड्थ इज 26 मिलीमीटर in ESP32, the length is 52 mm, where the width is 31 mm. In Arduino Uno, there are 14 digital input-output pins, where in ESP8266 there are 17 digital input-output pins. In ESP32, there are 36 digital input-output pins. In Arduino Uno, there are 6 pins with PWM. In ESP8266, there are 16 pins with PWM. And in ESP32, there are 16 pins with PWM. In Arduino Uno, there are 6 analog input pins. In ESP8266, there is only 1 analog input pin. In ESP32, there are 15 analog input pins. The operating voltage in Arduino is 5 volt, while in ESP8266 it is 2.5 volt to 3.3 volt, and in ESP32 it is 2.2 volt to 3.6 volt. The power supply in Arduino is 5 volt to 12 volt. In ESP8266 it is 5 volt, and it is same for ESP32. The current consumption in Arduino is 45 mA to 80 mA. In ESP8266, it is 15 microampere to 400 mA. In ESP32, it is 20 mA to 240 mA. Current consumption in deep sleep mode in Arduino it is 35 mA. In ESP8266, it is 0.5 microampere. In ESP32, it is 5 microampere. In Arduino, there is only one SPI, one I square C, one I square S, and one UART. In ESP8266, the communication protocols are two SPI, one I square C, two I square S, and two UART. In ESP32, the communication protocols are 4 SPI, 2 I square C, 2 I square S, and 2 UART. So, ESP32 has more communication protocols than other these two boards. In Arduino, the flash memory is 32 KB, where in ESP8266 it is 4 MB, and in ESP32 it is 4 MB. Arduino has a 2 KB of RAM, while ESP8266 have a 128 KB RAM, but in ESP32 it has 520 KB of RAM. Arduino has 1 KB of EEPROM memory, where in ESP8266 it has 520 bytes of EEPROM, but in ESP32 it does not have. And the clock speed of Arduino is 16 MHz. In ESP8266 the clock speed is 160 MHz. While in ESP32, it is more than 240 megahertz. No, Arduino does not have any temperature sensor. ESP8266 also does not have any temperature sensor, but ESP32 has one built in temperature sensor which calculates the internal temperature. No, Arduino does not have any. Hollypad sensor, ESP266 also does not have any Hollypad sensor, but ESP32 has one Hall effect sensor. No, Arduino does not have any touch sensor, ESP8266 also does not have any touch sensor, but ESP32 has 10 pins of touch sensors, means the pins are really touch sensitive. The cost of a real Arduino is $23. Then the cost of a clone Arduino is $7. And the cost of an ESP8266 is $5. And the cost 
Hop and ESP32 is $6. Yes, Arduino does not have any good specifications like I2S, CAN, Bluetooth, so it is not comparable with ESP32, but still I love Arduino. Yes, because of its simplicity. As you might know, Arduino was introduced in 2005 and ESP8266 in 2014 or in 2015, and where ESP32 was in 2016. Now, if you compare the latest model of Arduino, Arduino RP2040, which has a very high specifications like 16 MB of flash memory, input voltage of 5 to 21 volts, Bluetooth connectivity, then it is far better than SP32. But it is always depends on you. If you are a beginner, then of course you should go with Arduino Uno, or you can purchase Arduino Nano or ESP8266. If you have a good experience in electronics and programming or you are working on a big project then go for ESP32 or Arduino RP2040. Now you know which board is preferable for you. But if you are still a beginner then obviously see the upper playlist or if you want to stay updated then please see the bottom video.